select two faces from front side to extrude arms for hand cart go to the edit mesh menu and choose the extrude command select blue manipulate manipulating handle for the extrusion on Z axis and extrude a little it is the time you will have to show your wheel you may find any of your items by opening the outliner from the window menu you have all of your items here we have the name of poly surface one in blue color it means that our poly surface one is hidden double click the poly surface one and rename it wheel hit enter and now select the wheel and show your channel box and from channel box change the visibility of your wheel from off to on or simply put here the figure one hit enter hide the channel box and move your handle on Z axis backwards scale your handle and resize it view your work from all side sides and just adjust your handle to the wheel at this point again you need to soften your edges go to the select menu and choose the select edge loop tool just double click the edge what you want to bevel which you want to bevel and go to the edit mesh menu and choose the bevel options from here reduce the width of beveling and hit button of bevel you still have the edge loop tool with your cursor so again double click the inner side edge loop and bevel it oops your loop was not selected so, con so undo your action this time select one by one three of the edges and go to the edit mesh and choose bevel you may repeat these actions from bottom side of the handle get rid of the edge loop tool by clicking the quick select tool and now we are going to create the rear handle just right click on the object and choose face select the rear face and go to the extrude menu choose the extrude command and simply scale your face uniformly move the face on Z axis a little and extrude again the rear handle move the extrusion on Z axis and then resize the face from a little distance and once again go to the edit mesh and select extrude command and extrude again your handle create an other cylinder on the origin reduce rescale, rescale its size 
and fit it fit it into the wheel like an axle at this stage simply duplicate by pressing the control D on your keyboard the cylinder and move the cylinder on Z axis towards rear side backwards and reduce the size of the cylinder in length on X axis your hand cart is ready just combine three of the objects of handle just hit F8 for getting rid of this sub object level of edges and faces and you will see the selection level shift press shift and hold and select rear handle and select the axle and then go to the mesh menu and choose combine command you have combined three objects into one get the rotate tool and rotate on X axis your card here we go your hand card is ready thank you very much in the next lesson we are going to make an animation with the help of expression editor on this hand card. Thank you very much.